Hello there people, this is Mislav and today we are going to talk about what is the difference between the super user and a regular user. So the super user, also known as root, let me just write it down. So root, R-O-O-T, has some extra privileges on the Linux system. For example, if you are a regular user, and let's contrast root with other regular users, so let's just write this regular user and let's just put regular in quotation marks because you know basically other users are just users who are not root or the super user and let's just create an equal sign and just emphasize that when I say root I mean super user okay so to get back to the thread I was talking about before I started writing this on the screen, the super user, also known as root, has some extra privileges on the Linux system. For example, if you are a regular user, so if you are not the super user but the regular user, if you try to modify some files, you will most likely not be able to save them or you know you will be able to most likely modify them but when you try to save them you will get permission denied error and that's because system files are only accessible by the super user so the super user is the most powerful user on the linux system other users aren't as powerful meaning they can't modify some files and can't execute some commands that the super user can execute but guess what that is good how can that be good, you might wonder. Well, imagine you downloaded a malicious piece of software that tried to modify your system files and you are logged in as a regular user. When the malicious piece of software tries to modify some system files, it can't because a regular user can't modify them. You are running the program as a regular user and thus the malicious program can't modify the files. And basically, this is why Linux is secure, because if you're a regular user, as I just said, then a virus cannot really mangle around with some important files. Okay, so I hope this helped clarify the difference between the super user and other users, and I hope to see you in the next tutorial. And yeah, make sure to subscribe. I'm not really always saying it, you know, because I don't know, I think it will make the outro too long. I just like to say, see you in the next video and bye bye. But yeah, do make sure to subscribe. I will try to say it from time to time. And, you know, I really hope this video brings you value. I really hope you learn something. And I do hope that for that reason, you subscribe so that you are notified when other videos come out. Okay, that's it for this video. Talk soon.